Welcome to the Eduonix Play Framework course. Let's just take a moment to introduce the course. These are the learning goals of the course. That is, by the time the course is finished, you should be familiar with the following. To be able to set up a development environment with the Play Activator tool. Write tests and other common testing components with TypeSafe's built-in framework. Understand how a Play web application can be broken down into back-end and front-end components. When you learn about web applications, you will often hear developers talking about what they call the back-end and the front-end. We will understand what Play back-end application components are and how to configure them. Back-end components are generally related to persistence, that is, storing persistent data, in a database, whether it be relational or no SQL. Backend components are often concerned strongly with security and merging streams of data. This is particularly important for Play. Play has this concept of reactive components, and reactive streams are a very important high level backend component for Play applications and Play web applications. Play front end components are generally the part of the source code that you write that works inside the web browser. But this is breaking down. Now it's quite common to have front-end native applications that work with a Play back-end application. But generally when you're writing front-end components, you will break out of the Play framework and start to use other important frameworks such as AngularJS or Node.js. Also at a high level, we will understand the evolution of the Play Framework. Play Framework is evolving rapidly and its API is becoming more sophisticated. Play allows you to design reactive applications and distributed real-time applications using advanced components from other frameworks such as machine learning like Apache Spark. To support such advanced high-level code, you often need to break your code down into what's known as modules, and we will learn how to build modular Play applications. Play, with its Scala API, is perhaps the best framework for merging functional, big data, and machine learning technologies for web and other applications. As a result of our in-depth examination of Play's top-level reactive components, such as Acker and Spark, we will develop some fundamental Scala development skills.